everybody, welcome to today's video, and today we are putting that there hay wrap on that there bale. All right, so the way that this works is a hay bag is like a giant sock, and you have to basically slide it on here. If you don't have a tractor and you just have friends to help you, this is how we're going to do it. The end of this one is, uh, it has like this little thing right here. So first of all, the first thing you're going to do is be able to get this as wide as open. So you're going to scooch this end piece all the way here to the ends, untie it, and we're going to open up that end as much as possible. There you go. So now that you've got it, okay, Nikki, come help her on the other side and let's kind of pull it out and get that opening as wide as possible. There you go. This is so much easier with a friend. <laughs> and you've got to pull it all the way out because you've got to get it. And so, there you go. It, it's, there you go. you got to pull it. Pull it through. There you go. It takes a little work. We've got to get this as wide as possible. So anywhere where it gets stuck, you've got to make sure that it's not stuck for a reason. See, isn't that fun? All right. Now, next step is we're going to put that on the bale. We are going to try a method. One hand low, one hand high. Get it as big as you can. There you go, kind of make as much as you can. Kind of scoot your hand down here and we're going to just kind of scoot the bale cover around and put it on like a giant sock. I know, this bed is the fun. Sheet. You have bed sheet, okay. This is like a giant fitted bed sheet. Now, it's easier if you pull up all the stuff here on the bottom. Now, this is where your scissors come in. So, obviously, you're gonna start kind of cutting it right here, but you're gonna pull it all down before you pull out the Ooh, cover. The Cause you're gonna get the twine out. So, we're gonna start. So, cut down to about like right there. there. That, that'll work. All right, now not too much. We got to get, oh, be careful. All right, now we got to get all this past that point. So walk all the way around and just kind of start making it. <laughs> push it as much as you can. So it's more of a push pull and this takes a while because this bale is kind of fat. Okay, now we're at the fun part. And that is you pull it down and then you pull the bale wrap off as you go along. Now this one is like a giant sausage and it's taking a long time to pull. Now, if you have a tractor or a means to flip it over, you can flip it over and these are like the edges and so you know you've got the edges right there. Unfortunately, it just takes time and pulling it down and around as much as you possibly can to get it done. And if you don't get it all the way down, that's just fine. You just cut the binding twine, um, cut everything else down there and pull the bale down as you go. Luckily it's dry, so we don't really have to worry about having it up off the ground all that much. But yeah, this is just a lot of work and a lot of extra time. And it's not that fun, is it? <laughs> but it'll be totally worth it because yes, it does save a lot of waste. All right, so here you go. <laughs> We've been able to pull the um, bale wrap off and you got it all the way to the um, bottom. Now what's gonna happen is usually the horses start eating out the bottom. You wanna make sure you keep this area tight. So right here where you're at the end, you'll just take your little area, uh, take this little thing here and slide, and you're gonna tuck that up under. Now, as the horses eat the bale, you have several options. You can flip the whole thing over, or you can just keep getting this tighter and tighter, and there you go, that's bale wrap. Thank you guys so much for joining us on today's lesson, and if you enjoyed the lesson, Give us a like. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And remember to see more. Check out the playlist.